Oh, I'll play something else. Be careful what you fucking wish for, bitch. When one man is brought into the epicenter of disaster, and he is dealt with the hefty task of ridding the land of mutants, monsters, and motherfuckers, you have to ask yourself one thing. What the fuck are those flying little bugs? Or I'd like to point out, by the way... I'd like to point out nothing. Because I just got chomped in half by a fucking slender man with a duvet over his head. Oh, oh, I'm sorry, I thought I was in the... I... Oh, I thought I was in the tutorial. I thought I was in the tutorial. No, this is actually the game. This is... This is actually the game. This is, uh... I have a tomahawk. And I'd uh, like to point out, by the way, that this game... This, uh... This Flash game... Is, is... It mapped the aiming to the left fucking joystick. You know, when I saw a game called Call of Tomsk, I was almost fucking certain the Asdavuf movies had actually gotten its spin-off, and this was actually supposed to have been called Call of Tomska. Now please remember, this is on Steam! For cash money dollar. Now there are worse things out there. There are certainly worse things out there. But when this is advertised on the front fucking store page, there should be various questions running through your mind. If Valve are at a point where they don't want to make Half-Life 3 because of disappointment potential, why the fuck is this on the store page? Oh, by the way, Call of Tomsk 7? What happened to Call of Tomsk 1 through 6? Oh, and also, this is a side-scroller where you progress left. If there wasn't proof enough that this game is completely backward-minded, I don't know what the fuck would be there. This is Exhibit A3 motherfucking Z. As a lone gunman wanders through the various abyss, wondering what he has to do in order to survive, he finds himself asking that one pivotal question. Why am I here? Why am I doing these things? And why have I not left? And I pressed... Why and there's a... Helicopter? What is g- Thanks. I hope I live to see what that is. <coughs> I can't help but think this would work a hell of a lot better if the movement and the aiming was not mapped to the same fucking joystick. Soldier, we need you to get to Tomsk 7. We're bringing in a bomb, hold out till then. And remember, always aim for the head. Anything less just makes them angry. Oh, so that's why I'm here. I'm bringing a bomb to the thing, despite the fact we just saw a helicopter that dropped a box. Why well, couldn't the helicopter drop the bomb? See, there are many questions. If you can drop the box off there, why don't you drop me off there? If you could drop the box off there and me off there, why not drop me where the fucking bomb needs to be placed? I'm just simply saying, if you're going to produce the illusion that I need to be forcing myself through these hordes of Babylon bastards, you should at least be consistent with the message you are sending. Oh, and now the bug is attacking his head, and the bug... The bug killed him? Are the bugs on my side? Is this just a gross misunderstanding? Oh, Jesus Christ, he just spawned on... What kind of unfair bug? Did he spawn on a tomahawk and then that hit him and killed him? Like, the, the tomahawk was already in the person, falling, and he spawned into it and then died. Oh, and now I'm surrounded by bugs. This is... This is great. Oh, what? What? what okay, this is... Yep. Okay. Oh! It did... Oh my god, the quality control is so astronomically non-existent you'd think we were talking about the fucking charged imaginary friend. S -t -t Valve. Steam. Baby. Oh, Jesus Christ. No, let's keep going. Let's keep- I'm gonna- I'm gonna complete this fucking game. We're gonna see what's at the end of this goddamn road. You know, I really wish this was Call of Tomska, because then I could just release myself from this eternal misery by saying that one simple phrase. I like trains. <laughs> 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 I just unlocked a hat that gives me 35 Molotov cocktails. What the? Oh, okay, yeah, that's, they can just, uh, yeah, flood infection form. This, this is literally what it is. It's literally, it's, it's exactly what it is. It's a grey, depressed, out of shape, lanky motherfucking flood infection carrier form and it's, it brings out the Beatles. <laughs> I love the way it tinks off of his head. Like, I'm not even kidding. That fucking noise! It's like hitting his head isn't enough to crack it open, but the floor is the only thing capable of impenetrating the glass you have sub- What? Why? I <laughs> You'd think you'd be rewarded for hitting them with it! No! There are that 
many Beatles. You'd think Ringo Starr was part of the fucking Clone Wars. And apparently I'm... I don't know what I am. <laughs> I look almost kind of like a samurai with that helmet, but then I've got a fat hazmat suit on with fucking George Brown pants on. I... <sighs> This game is an enigma, and I'd like to point out, by the way, that so far I have encountered a massive, whopping, three different enemy types. Three. Just in case we're... just so we're completely clear. There are more unique background tiles that are fucking clearly mirrored than actual enemies of gameplay. This background tiling is amazing! What the fuck is this Babby's first photoshop? Fuck a doodle... oh. 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 Uh, what do I do? I, is this it? Do, do I get evacuated? You're gonna come down and pick me up? No, no. Is, but okay, I've, I've gone. I've gone all the way left. Uh. I can't go left anymore. Um. Well. I guess I just stay here, maybe? Have I been left here to die? Yes, definitely! Oh no! No! Wait, do these bullets have drop off? They. These bullets have drop off! This isn't a sniper rifle at fucking 3,000 yards! This is a submachine gun at like 3 meters! This is the game. This, this, this is, this is the, this is the point of the game you are destined to get to- What the fucking shitty dicks am I playing? And there's a challenge mode. F fuck me. You've... You had me- hello. Oh, you just spawned underneath me. Oh, and what is this game? What? It spawned underneath me. The game is a- Fucking 2D side-scroller, where the enemies have the capacity, ability, and the god-given fucking right to spawn underneath your feet and gobble you up like a tasty treat. I am lost for words. I can't get past these fucking mirrored tiles. Could you not even make a longer one so it didn't look shit? Look at that! Fucking! This is a- this is a miracle. This is a mir this is on the same storefront that features Fallout 3. This is the same storefront you can pre-order Fallout 4. This is the same storefront that actually sells legitimately good indie games. Legitimately fucking worthwhile ones! And this got a featured panel. The oh. I think tomorrow you should feature a certain fighting game, Injustice, because that's what this is. This is an Injustice. You f Hungry pile of monotonous, rotting gums. What the fuck? Oh, I'm at the end. Uh, this is it. Oh no, I get it now. I get what the mission is. It's to survive till the countdown goes to zero, isn't it? That's a very long time. Because each second is like ten. So I need to literally survive this for, what, thirty minutes? I mean, let's say each second is five. That's fifteen. This is a really long time. This is the mission. The main game is survive endlessly. The first mission of the supposed challenge mode is just survive for a certain amount of specified time. And I right. The mission is that I have no equipment. Great. No way of replenishing ammo, and no equipment to conserve it. This, is, this isn't... I know it's called challenge mode, and yeah, it's challenging, but so is chopping off my legs and telling me to run a mile. This, this, this isn't a fucking challenge, this is impossible. Who the fuck did... I want to meet the fucking designer of this, seriously. I'm not going to take this to a stupid realm of art. Yeah, I'll beat them up and tell them what's... Fu that's... That, that fucking spawn right in front. I'm glad, I'm glad, now I get to see what Mission 3 is. I can't. <laughs> you ready for Mission 5? I don't think I'm ready for Mission 5. What's Mission 5? Okay, I have, um, 105 bullets, 6 pieces of equipment, 
and I need to survive what I assume to be is... 10 minutes. Because each second on that counter takes 5 to 10, and I'm assuming 5 and being lenient. So, this is... This is real nice. Hang on, I'll count. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, it's literally 10. It's literally fucking 10. You need to survive 20 minutes. You need to survive 20 minutes with 105 bullets. I know you think I'm being a nitpicky motherfucker, but this is the game that they are presenting to you. This is the challenge mode they expect you to fucking... Oh. And it takes like 8 bullets to kill one of them. I mean, I missed a couple. So again, I'm being lenient. I'm giving the game credit. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. There you go. 7. Seven fucking bullets, and you're given a hundred and fucking fifteen. And one of the challenges, literally one of the challenges, seeing as one second equals ten, and one of them was a 180, requires you to survive for thirty minutes. <laughs> thirty minutes! <laughs> With no ammo pickups! Sorry, that just sunk in. Because I don't know how the fuck you could play this for 30 minutes, says the man who's played it for 53 and has fucking nearly killed himself. Oh my god, what are you... <laughs> this is on Steam. Look! It's fucking fair! Stop it! Don't you fucking move. No. It is there. It is on the fucking featured store page. <sighs> like, it's just... It's just there. It's... 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 Oh my! I thought I, I thought I imagined it. I went to check the Steam app. It wasn't there. I guess it's because I bought it. Went to the fucking website. There it was. The featured front fuck. I. And what you gonna do? And on that note. The episode's clearly over and I'm never giving this fucking game a chance again and I think I'm just gonna swear off ever trying variety for the sake of variety because this was a fucking abortion. For all intents and purposes, the game should have been aborted, but it wasn't. No, it pulled through and we've got a half fucking formed fetus on the store page. Anyway! If you enjoyed this... this... thing of me screaming at a fucking... disgusting piece of filth, then like the videos, let me know and I won't make more of it. Unless you're that insane enough to actually want more of it in this case, oh, let me know. As soon as my content is over, you should check out someone else that I'm featuring because, hey, what you got to lose? For instance, Chatronic, because he recently put out a new video which is absolutely hilarious and I loved it, so watch it. I promise you, you won't regret it. And speaking of not regretting things, please follow me on Twitter. If I'll about a bunch, I'll get to update you on things, you get to be in the loop and you'll even get a couple of jokes, bitches and things, and hey, maybe I'll even take your opinion for future stuff. And, uh, considering this... All of this, I think it's safe. To <laughs> I think it's safe to say that despite what this was evidently made with, even the lowest of lows, even this could not ever achieve being a flash in the pan. Off button doesn't work when you die. What's <laughs> my favourite? What's <laughs> my fucking favourite, man? Oh, <laughs> oh you spent an hour playing that game. <laughs> I probably have more fucking hours logged playing this than the whole fucking community of people that bought it. Oh my god.